So TMG fan, man, listen, right now, about to go down is the funniest 911 calls, bro. <laughs> listen, if you've been rocking with me for a minute, then you already know I have a little bit, somewhat of a little bit of experience with this, all right? Uh, me being a firefighter back in the day, having to interact with 911 dispatchers, bro, sometimes it could get a little bit hilarious, fam. Seriously. Uh... For, for one call in particular, man, we were dispatched to a, a house on fire. We get in there, and normally we kind of take it up a notch if we hear. We're already up a notch, but we take it up several more notches if you hear entrapment, meaning that it's people trapped inside, right? They said they had 12 people trapped inside. So we are locked in, loaded. When we get there, man... They say, yeah, the ladies outside screaming, my babies, my babies, my babies. We get out. She was talking about cats. Now, to my animal lovers, those are your babies. Correctly, correctly. But them cats had done made it out way before she did, bro. Like, they were gone way before she did. You know what I mean? So that was one of the funny ones, man. <laughs> Laughing back and forth with dispatch about, uh, you know what I mean? So... Let's check this video out, and we're gonna get into it. Here we go. I think somebody broke into my house. Can you believe it, wrong? Okay, stay where you are. We're gonna send someone over right now. Hang on, I'm gonna investigate. You do not have to do that. Oh, it ain't nobody, on It's a dog, and I hate dogs. If there's a dog, it could be rabbit. Do not approach it. I'm approaching the rabbit dog now. Do not approach the dog. I think it's a labradoodle. Looks like a baby. <gasps> Sir, get out of the room. The dog is in my face. Oh, oh, oh. It's kids to me. Oh, this is very nice. And now I like dogs. <laughs> yo, yo, now I like dogs. And y'all know them 911 dispatchers be laughing too, bro. They be having to hold on to the mic, look away, and laugh a little bit too, bro. I know they sound serious, but trust me. They be trying not to break character as well. They human just like you. So is everything okay? Oh yeah, it is very okay. I'm getting kissed by a dog. I think I'll name him Gregory. Okay, great. Um, may I ask how did the dog enter your house? Well, I installed the doggy door last week. Kids and puppy want to come on in. Mm. Goodbye, sir. <laughs> she banged it on him. <laughs> Yo. Yo, you be surprised. I'm telling you, man. I'm telling you. It may not be one of the highest paying jobs, but interesting, entertaining, funny sometimes. Oh, yeah. Now, one of dispatchers got some stories, man. That was crazy right there. You installed it. How do you get in there, sir? I installed the doggy door. Why he was talking like that in the first place? 911, what's your emergency? There's a bottle of conditioner in me. What? My wife and I belong to a wholesale club and got a really big bottle of Mother Jeffrey's male hair conditioner. Uh-huh. We were in the shower and we put it in the end, but it went all the way in. Your wife put the bottle in... Um, in my, um, in the, uh, my behind. Ah, you kinky little nasty little dirty little son of a... Come on, y'all, y'all, y'all want to recreate the scene, huh? Imagery-wise, in your mind, recreate that scene in your mind. How did that conversation go? Oh, got to We're out of lube. <laughs> oh, don't worry about it. Get the conditioner. Oh. <laughs> yo, yo, we're out of lube. Get the conditioner. Oh, you know, you know, right? When he started saying it, it hurt. And it's in, oh, it's in there. <laughs> it's like, who gonna make the call? No, you make the call. I ain't making the call. You make the call. We're gonna send an ambulance. Can you wait? Mm -hmm. Yeah. 
You heard her break? You heard her break? <laughs> she laughing. Listen to her. Me in, but it went all the way in. Your wife put the bottle in. Um, in my, um, in my, uh, my behind. We're going to send an ambulance. Can you wait? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Are you all right? Oh, yeah. I, I was just a little surprised. I would be surprised, too. I'm sorry, one second. Sweetie, can you please get the cat out of here? Uh, the ambulance is about four minutes away. Oh, no. I can really feel it. Bottle? I think I'm going to see it. Is that bad? <laughs> oh, you mean... <laughs> Yo, what the fuck? Oh, fam said I sneezed. Yeah, I heard the bottle hit the floor. Bottle? I think I'm going to see it. Is that bad? Oh, you mean... Hey, it came out. No, where's the cat? 911, what's your emergency? I did something bad. Is anyone hurt? I kissed somebody else. <laughs> I kissed somebody else. I don't even know him. Is this an emergency? Just no. Are you on the ground? Ma'am, can you hear me? Ma'am, I'm sorry. Ma'am. I kissed somebody. No, why don't you do that, sister? Because I'm afraid I will go to someone who's cold. No, no, you're not a screw up, okay? I screw up all the time. Ma'am. God, it hurts, but I forgive you. I love you. Oh, my God, but I love you. No, no. Oh, yes, will you marry me? Oh, wow. Yes, I love you. Yes. Oh, you nasty. Oh, she just, oh. How do you go from I screwed up, I kissed somebody else, to will you marry me? To her vomiting everywhere. <laughs> them be them drunk nights, bro. Ah, oh, them drunk nights. Ah. Oh. Ah. Oh. Uh, congratulations. Goodbye. I want pizza. One, what's your emergency? Hey, man. Yeah, I saw I'm cooking something here. I was wondering how much trouble you could get in for uh, meth. And you've called the police to ask how illegal meth is? Well, yeah, I figured if anyone would know, it'd be you guys. Is this Darnell Bickham's of Cherrywood Road? No, uh, Darnell's not here right now. Can I take a message? No. Uh, the police are on their way, Darnell. Oh, shit, nuts. I mean, yeah, that's fine, because nothing's wrong here sending me just cooking some meth. Oh, double nuts, I said it again. See you soon, Darnell. All right, it was great talking to you. Good talking to you, too. All right, see y'all in a little bit. <laughs> that better not be real. Or he is the dumbest person I've ever heard. That can't be real. That fool is dumb, dumb. That's super dumb. I that's different type of dumb. That's next level dumb. That's idiot dumb. I oh fam, are you serious right now? Nine one one, what's your emergency? I have knife hands. Excuse me. I looked down and my hands were knives. Your hands are knives. Yeah. Can you put the knives down? No, they're my hands. All right. Uh, where are you? I don't want knife hands. I uh, can't pet my cat. I can't high-five anything. It's okay, sir. Let's work this out. He high. What am I going to do? Be a chef? Just chop, chop, chop my whole life. Nothing but chopping. No, uh, chop that. How did you call 911? I called on my phone. Uh -huh. And uh, how did you dial the number? With my fingers. Okay. Where are your fingers? On my hands. Oh, God, you're back. <laughs> oh, thank you. Oh, my God. Look at you. My monkey's back. God, they're back. Um, what's your name? Is it Sharon? No. Oh, Sharon, you're an angel. I am not. Mm, that's what an angel would say. Thank you, Sharon. You're welcome. <laughs> Sir, how did you dial? My fingers? Oh, they're back. <laughs> this acid is really messing with me. Oh, boy. We know. We know. You on a crazy trip right now. Wait, now my feet are nice. One woman, what's your emergency? There are demon worshippers in a cul-de-sac. Are you in immediate danger? I think so. Okay, what is the threat? There's a man pulling dead squirrels out of his hat. How is that a threat? The kids are singing devil songs, whacking a horse effigy. Oh, Lord, they're eating what came out of his head. Ma'am, do you see any party streamers? Yes. Do you see a cake? You mean a pagan pastry? I do. That is a child's birthday party. Ma'am? She just realized how dumb she is. I wouldn't say nothing at this point either. <laughs> oh my gosh, bro.
Oh, are you sh me right now? Whew. I'd like to report a uh, hate crime. A hate crime? Yes, I was not invited to my neighbor's kid's party. All right, well, Paradise is a small town. You are actually not the first person to call about this. The child in question is very popular, but his parents limited the guest list to 20. I needed to hear that. Thank you. Emergency. How are you doing, Virginia? You got to send an ambulance to one of the schools. Where are you? The buggy. I just, ah, uh, ah. Uh. I just need someone to call for me. I've been scooping out. You're going to be okay. Can you wait for the ambulance? No, I'm going to try to fight. Make a little room. Just please wait. Okay, good. Oh, God. I've got to taste just a little bit of it. No, no. Why would you why? do that? I mean, how are you? It's okay. It's a credit spec. Just stop eating. I've got dollars. Fucking spicy. Yeah. Make me a fucking lawsuit. Don't get a whole picture. Put it in my don't mouth. Don't drink anything. Oh. Don't eat anything. Just oh. wait. Uh, Oh. oh, God, I'm a mess. This is a low point. I'm on the floor. My shoulder's open. I got a yogurt all over my neck. Oh, fuck. My ex-wife is just going to see me like this. Just stay where you are. I'm half naked and I'm soaking wet. I got to get out of here. Oh, I hate that yet. I shit my pants. Why he sound like Peter Griffin to me? <laughs> Listen to his voice, bro. On the floor. My shoulder's open. I got a yogurt all over my neck. Oh, fuck. Hey, ladies, y'all looking for somebody? <laughs> huh? He on the floor, half naked. Yogurt all over his body, waiting on you. I have twice for sure. Any single ladies out there? Like this. Just stay where you are. I'm half naked and I'm soaking wet. I gotta get out of here. Oh, I hate that yet. Oh, 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 I just hit my pants. Emergency. I'm being kidnapped. Okay, do you know where you are? I have some pay. So he called me a cab, but this is not a cab. It's just a 2008 Toyota Camry. Well, where are you in the car? I'm right behind the driver. Oh, now he's picking up someone else. Yeah? Yeah. Do you know what that's name? A lady named Ann. Is that an Uber pool? Is this fool in an Uber pool and thinking she's being kidnapped? This seems familiar. Now they're not talking. Is it possible that your grandson ordered you a ride share or a pool? A pool? They're going to drown me? They're not going to drown. <laughs> oh. A pool? They're going to drown me. <laughs> On you. Teddy's the only one who knows I can't swim. The true crime documentary of this is going to be shocking. Okay, where are you now? We're going to my house. I think this is the end. They're going to kill me in my own home. Ma'am, when the car stops, you can just go ahead and get out. Okay, we're pulling up. Oh, oh, you're right. Then let me get out. Wow, they're driving away. Wait, where's my purse? They robbed me. Don't worry. I'm sure Teddy can call and get your purse back. How do you know his name? Who is this? I, I think we're... Hey, more than that. What is the end of... Oh my gosh, bro. <laughs> oh, I've never in the history of never have I ever heard of somebody. Oh man, getting in an Uber pool and thinking they were kidnapped. Oh my gosh, bro. This is crazy. I kind of want to go be a 911 dispatcher for a day now. Oh, yeah, you know, it looks pretty tall. He, he probably uses some astringent of, of some kind. No, tone, color, skin color. What's his race? Whoa, uh, I, that, that took a, a weird turn. Uh, I just need you to describe the suspect. Well, his skin color, uh, if you have to ask, apparently we live in a world where we have to ask about that. Oh, you see everything through. of a headache man i need to kind of take this hat off bro this fool said take the skin to white skin and darken it <laughs> <laughs> oh 
Oh, oh. <laughs> when did 911 dispatch turn into our comedy hour? Holy jeez. Hold on, man. You can't just say that like that. Summer, uh, if you have to ask, apparently we live in a world where we have to ask about that. Oh, you see everything through the prism of skin color. It's, it's a dark white. I don't even know what that means, sir. Dark white skin. What? Take the shade of white. Dark. <laughs> Take the shade of white. Darken it. At least we know he not racist, bro. He can't be. A person like this, no way. They can't be racist. He can't be racist, bro. It's not possible. <laughs> I just got to hear how he, say, how he put it together one last time, and I'm done, y'all. I'm done. Oh, I, that, that took a, a weird turn. I just needed to describe the suspect. Well, his skin color, uh, if you have to ask, apparently we live in a world where we have to ask about that. Oh, you see everything through the prism of skin color. It's, it's a dark white. I don't even know what that means, sir. Dark white skin. What? Take the shade of white. Dark. <laughs> That's you, shade. Okay, sir, I'm not up service and a doctor or whatever. Sir, are you injured? Uh, I think so, but I can't really tell what's left. What's left of what? My wife was in the bathroom, so I figured I'd just go in the sink and I slipped in my own piss and cut my dog in the sink hole. I tried to pull myself up and hit the dang switch and got the dispose out turned on. Wait, what? I just round up my own dick. Are you serious? Give me a minute. Give me a minute. Give me a minute. Mm. Ah. Serious? I just ground up my own dick. <laughs> oh my god. The disposal has disposed my dick all over the walls. Sir, help is on the way. Oh man, it's like a Tasmanian devil one buck wild on some spaghetti in here. Sir, if you can unlock your door, the EM. Spaghetti. Oh. He will assist you. Oh man, it's like a slip aside from hell. Oh. Bro, that is the craziest I've ever seen or heard of in my entire life. Bro, I was cringing, yet it was the funniest description of a cringy situation that you'll ever ever, ever here. Oh my gosh, bro. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, y'all. I, I got a roll after that one, man. I, I can't even close it. Till next reaction, man, I'm out of peace. Y'all stay solid. Hey.